There we go. All right. Hi, Aaron. Wait. Hi, Aaron. <laughs> I know. This is like um the Brady Bunch. <laughs> I I probably couldn't track all of the conversations, but um so thank you for joining me. Well, first off, thanks for sending the the video. Um I appreciated the one minute teaser video that you sent. There were geese in the background. I don't know if that was um I, I don't know if you were aware of that, but since we're working together on the book for Goose, I just thought that was uh, the universe being fun. Well, I'm glad that you were outside. Like, I, I feel like um, we're seeing a lot of Zoom videos. You and I have our sparkle lights um, behind us, which is a good break. But I'm, I, those white walls, like, and I just love that your video was outside. So I love that you're getting outside. So one of the things that um, I thought was a good discussion for us to have is being uh, in quarantine, in, intro in introversion quarantine. That wasn't English. Can you edit that for me real quick? <laughs> Yes. Yeah. So, I mean, and I know um, because I am a introvert that can play in an extroverted world, uh, that's also like its own little subsection of introversion. So um, I just thought we could chat about that for a second. Yeah, well, and I can tell you that I'm enjoying not going to the store. I'm enjoying not going into town. I'm enjoying not driving into. Okay, so I'm enjoying like going, not going into town. I'm enjoying not, um, let me know if that's better because I turned the volume up. Oh, well, I mean, that's just part of this conversation. I'm actually using this guy, so I'm I'm hoping that that's. No, I didn't. I can I could put my face on it and snuggle with it, but that would just be the screen. Um, so for the rest of this discussion, I'm gonna feel like I just gotta hold it right here. 
And are you getting the pieces of the earth in the background from my green screen? <laughs> that's fine. That's that's perfect. Um, so, I, yeah, I mean, I didn't anticipate that when I painted. When I painted the wall green, I was not anticipating green screen. Um, but this is kind of one of those silver lining things. So with the introversion thing, one of the one of the things that um, is interesting is I'm recognizing I am not uh, envious or anxious to get back to going to the store and going back into town. And you know, I live out in the middle of the country, and I'm like not I'm not stoked about that. And people are like, "Can't we just get back to the new normal?" And I'm like, uh, I'm. I'm okay for right now. I'm not going to say I'm going to be okay in two more weeks of this. This is what week five for where we're at. Um, but there's a lot of feelings out there that are being put out there that are being put out as global feelings. And I can tell you that they're not bunny feelings right now. Yeah. 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 And I'm, I'm jotting down little pieces of almost like a recipe list for the life that I'm looking forward to in the future of what pieces and parts of the silver lining that I found from the quarantine and from the shelter in place and a mixture of what uh, things brought me joy and that I enjoyed from when we didn't have mandatory shelter in place. And I feel like it's going to be one heck of a recipe and one heck of a dish that I cook up um in the future and i'm i'm really looking forward to that you know and there are pieces and parts of like i i think i sent you at one point like seven different pieces of writing uh in one day and i i don't think that's probably gonna happen in the future um but it felt good for that moment <laughs> Well, I'm going to let you get back to that self time. I do appreciate you giving me some of your time and sharing that with difference makers, as well as the recording that I know is going to be in that teaser video that by the time people watch this video, they'll probably have already heard the geese and seen your little teaser video. So, um, and then I also look forward to, I think I tapped you to host some of these difference makers conversations. So um, once these come out, I guess you can chat your, the way that only Aaron can with some of your difference makers. Maybe we can get some from, um, France and I'm not saying do it in French because I would have to hit the books really hard to keep up with that difference makers conversation. <laughs> 
But I think there's an opportunity that there's difference makers all across the world. And this is one of those things that we're experiencing as a world, as a human race. And that's really unique as well. So I just wanted to recognize that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think that's just being a human and being aware of, of being a human, at least for me. And, you know, I think that goes to um, rising tides raises all ships, boats, ducks that are sitting on the ocean. <laughs> I think that's a good place to wrap this discussion up. And I'm probably going to go sit with a uh, cool beverage after this. So <laughs> thank you for making a difference and being a difference maker, Aaron. And um, yeah. Uh, salut. <laughs>